Back to tonight's top story. A Phoenix man ran into a burning shop to save motorcycles, and he says he did it right after he lost everything to the Alameda fire. NBC 5's Katie Strike met this man, and Katie, why did he say he did it? Christina Scott Flick says he's lived in the Rogue Valley since he was eight years old. He was devastated to watch his community burn and says helping one business owner was the least he could do. I got these KTMs out through the locked door. One man running towards flames, breaking the window of a shop, taking nine motorcycles, but it wasn't what it looked like. I guess it was the thought of me just losing mine. I just didn't, I just thought it was wrong to let all those bikes burn. How did Scott Flick get here? Flick first heard about a fire in Ashton from his neighbor, but he didn't know the magnitude of what was to come. They asked me if, I, if they thought there was anything was going to burn. I said, no, there's nothing going to burn there. Hours later, he headed back home to Phoenix, or at least he tried, but the roads were closed. I didn't know everything was on fire. He ditched his car and hopped on his bike and came across a tragic scene. Seeing that my place was completely burned and the neighbors were completely burned. As winds picked up speed, the fire came with it. I mean, it was just bang, bang, boom, ba boom. He watched the fire swallow the DNS Harley. As the flames started making their way towards Oregon Motorcycle Adventures KDM, Flick, a motorcycle rider, says he couldn't just stand by. Now, I tried to rip the door handle, the inner one off, but I couldn't get it off from the outside, so I had to step inside and rip it off. KTM owner Jeff Moffitt said Flick managed to rescue nine bikes. When they told me that a guy broke into the store and saved the motorcycles, I had a really good idea of who it was. Flick may have lost his own home, but he's keeping his spirits up. You got to focus on the little good there is, because that's all there is to keep from crying. But he says the possessions he'll miss most are the very ones he faced flames to save. I miss riding motorcycles bad. I, I get choked up every time thinking about my best friend Burnt. You can almost see it from here. <laughs> Scott Flick has a GoFundMe set up, and we will have that on our website, kobi5.com, after the show. Live in studio, Katie Strait, NBC5 News.